hi Omasa welcome back to my channel my client was kind enough to allow me record this tutorial for her birthday shoot please this tutorial is not a detailed one but trust me you will learn one or two from this if you want to see how i created this look please keep on watching and please do not forget to click on the subscribe button if today is your first time on my channel and if you have been my subscriber i want to say thank you once more so i started off by applying her foundation today i used two foundations literally drugstores one is from newborn beauty and the other one is maybelline fits me foundation this is the og the OG of all foundation. This foundation is affordable and it does the job. The coverage is medium and is buildable. It's one of my favorite foundation. So after foundation application, I went in with my concealer. Um, today I used um, Huda Beauty foundation as a concealer. I wanted I like um, the consistency when I tried it out on a previous client, and I decided to you know use it for the same video i'm using my flat brush to you know place it under her eyes before going in with my beauty sponge one of my followers in my previous video gave me that correction i know it's a beauty sponge but i'm used to calling it a beauty blender and i know most people call it beauty blender but thank you thank you for the correction so now i'm blending it out using my in today's video i used my white glam cosmetics beauty sponge this is one of my favorite um beauty sponge if you've been watching my video you know i rave about this product this product is quite affordable and it does the job it doesn't suck up your product like some of the sponge i've used so that's why i've st I, like i've st i'm stuck with this one I've been using it for a while for over a year and I don't have any complaint at all so after that with my fluffy brush I'm going to be applying a compact powder first the compact powder I use for this video is my Milani compact powder I use the lightest shade I think the shade medium to set my foundation before going in with my setting powder after this video i felt like i need to go back to my previous um, method of contouring and highlighting because i noticed this one makes me pack a whole lot of products which i'm not used to i like my makeup soft subtle and straight to the point so i'm using my new newborn beauty setting powder in the shade caramel i think i'm going to be setting the concealer after i've placed the compact powder so this is what i'm doing this process you don't need to do your cream contour after this i went in with my dabel cosmetics um, powder i'm using the dark shade from the palette to contour her cheekbone the bridge of her nose and her forehead So next is eyes. I did her brows off camera because of time. And now I'm applying the brown powder from my powder palette. She said she wanted a very clean eye. So it's more like powder 
on her eyes i'm blending out using my blending brush so for her eyes basically what i used is my dabel cosmetic powder palette for the eyes after the application and blending I'm going to be adding a little bit of rhinestone to pop it a bit because the shoot, like I said earlier, was for her birthday. Now I'm putting on the rhinestones. After that, I went ahead to start blending her face. I'm done with the eyes. I'm using a fluffy powder brush. I'm blending on her forehead. Then I'm going to repeat this process all over her face, her cheek, all around her face. I'm going to blend out before I start applying powder at the necessary areas. Now is her nose. Whenever you're doing your makeup, see, blending is very important. If you don't blend your makeup, it's going to look terrible. So you have to take your time. I don't know how long it takes other people to blend, but to help you with your blending always concentrate at the strategic point which is the nose the forehead the cheek make sure you're blending the highlight and the contour together to avoid lines then after that i've gone along to apply my blush in this video the blush is kind of too much but watch me correct this so whenever you do your makeup and you encounter any problem all you have to do is to take a deep breath take your time know how to solve the situation because once you panic it's going to affect every other thing that you're doing nobody is perfect this is act art sorry art 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 so you're going to make mistakes once in a while so know what to do to correct your mistakes in this situation what i did is that i went ahead with a brown powder so the powder toned down the blush and i used another cream product on it this is not a detailed video i'm still going to make a video on how i do some corrections especially when i'm on a bridal job because you know it's a different ball game when you're doing makeup in your studio and when you went for an outdoor job because weddings are usually very demanding so you have to be how am i going to put it you have to always be in charge that's the word no matter the situation don't allow people see that you're going through it so comport yourself so that's it so now is her lip i'm going to okay for this lip she i used basically all her products because i loved it she showed me and i loved it so i went ahead to use some of it and i mixed it with my lip you know some of my lip stains so now i'm going to be lying with um my eye magic cosmetic palette so i'm using the brown from the palette so i'm going to make sure i outline her lip just to give it like a nice structure so guys there's a good news oh my god like when this close to monetization i got a mail that i'm eligible for monetization so i filled my form i'm waiting for an official you know i was even an official mail from youtube and when that happens girls are going to be having a chit chat like it's going to be a massive chit chat where you know i get to interact with you guys do my makeup just i'll keep you guys posted and i want to say a very huge thank you to each and every one of my subscribers you guys have been amazing and i love you guys so 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 much this morning i am super excited this is supposed to be a tutorial but i'm ranting too much because i'm so happy so watch out i'm going to be having a chit chat with you guys if you have any question for me please put it on the comment section i'll be glad to answer every question you know i saw a comment this morning where someone said that my youtube has been growing so fast and it made me so happy because i now realize that you guys realize that you guys have been in this journey with me and it makes me happy to know like i'm going a very huge family and i can't wait to talk to you guys thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you please 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 
If you're new on my channel, please do not forget to click on the subscribe button. Subscribe button. Please don't forget to share my video. Tell your friends to tell another friend. And trust me, I'm going to make this channel. What's it? Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Thank you. So I'm doing the finishing touches, adding more rhinestones. You know, this is not the best of my look, but at the end of the day, it turned out so, 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 so nice. And this is the finished look. Thank you guys so much for sticking by me or sticking with me or sticking everywhere with me. I don't know what to say. So see you in my next video. I love you guys. Bye.